Our plan for the production of powdered pharmaceuticals in Krasnodar has been operating in the pharmaceutical market for more than 10 years. Last year the management of our enterprise decided to improve the processes at the production to optimize the operation of the equipment. At the general meeting on the development of production, the chief engineer suggested purchasing a capsule transporter. It will provide remote transfer of capsules from the container to the hopper of the technological equipment and thereby ease the labor intensity of the working processes. I had been working at the enterprise for 10 years as a leading production technologist, and I was given the task to search for and purchase the capsule transporter for the packing area. I began my search, checking the required capacity with the chief engineer in advance. He also suggested that I first contact the manufacturers of equipment. They provide warranty service, drawings, instructions for use, carry out installation, and mounting of manufactured equipment. I followed his advice. I chose one company online in Italy, which produces pharmaceutical equipment. I visited their website and wrote a letter in which I indicated the desired parameters and the capabilities of the machine. They replied that they did have a capsule transporting machine. The manager asked for my phone number and said she would call me back in the evening when she checked with her company engineer about the capabilities of the automatic equipment. However, she did not call in the evening. I contacted them the next day. The manager said that she had passed the request on to the design department and that she would contact me when she got an answer. This seems strange to me. When do I wait for an answer? How long to wait for an answer? Absolutely no business approach to the customer. I refused to look for vacuum conveyor on my own. And then I remembered that at the Forum of Producers of Equipment for the Pharmaceutical Industry in Moscow, I met a specialist who was engaged in the selection and supply of equipment for the production of medicines. I found his business card and before contacting him I decided to check whether he really engaged in the supply of machines for the pharmaceutical industry. In order to do this I found his company's website and carefully studied the information on it. I liked that the website was up to date with video clips of the equipment and many contacts for communication. I also noticed that the website had been around since 2003. The company had been on the equipment supply market for a long time and that is a good reason to say that it was successful. I called the manager. He said he remembered me and was happy to hear from me again. I told him that I was looking for automatic equipment for transporting powder to production. He suggested a capsule transporter with a metal detector. This machine is popular with customers and has been proven in production. I agreed to consider it. The manager emailed me the passport and instructions for the equipment. He also offered to perform a turnkey delivery. I liked the proposed version of the equipment and I agreed it with the management. A week later we made a contract for the delivery of the capsule carrier with a metal detector. I sent a small batch of our capsules to the manager of the company to test the machine. The equipment, as I wanted, was compact with simple and convenient controls. The management, myself included, was satisfied with the automatic capsule handling equipment offered. I realized that I made the right choice of a professional to supply the equipment. It was a pleasure to talk to a professional who knew his business. Experience has shown that no matter how confident you are in your abilities, consulting a specialist will speed up the solution to the task at hand and free up time that can be spent to your advantage.